This uh, poem is in a collection called Erotica, an anthology of women's writing, edited by Margaret Reynolds with a foreword by Jeanette Winterston. Winterson. And we're going to be reading a poem by Marilyn Hacker from her collection, Love, Death, and the Changing of the Seasons, published in 1987. This poem uses the traditional form of the sonnet sequence to trace a year-long affair between the poet speaker and her younger lover, Rachel. Didn't Sappho say her guts clenched up like this? Before a face suddenly numinous, her eyes watered, knees melted. Did she lactate again, milk brought down by a girl's kiss? Its documented torrents are unloosed by such events as recently produced not the wish, but the need to consume in us one pint of Maalox, one of Kaopectate. My eyes and groin are permanently swollen. I'm alternatingly brilliant and witless and sleepless. Bed is just a swamp to roll in. Although I'd cream my jeans touching your breast, sweetheart, it isn't lust. It's all the rest of what I want with you that scares me shitless. First, I want to make you come in my hand while I watch you and kiss you. And if you cry, I'll drink your tears while with my whole hand I hold your drenched loveliness contracting. And after a breath, I want to make you full again and wet. I want to make you come in my mouth like a storm. No tears now. The sum of your parts is my whole most beautiful chart of the constellations. Your left breast in my mouth again. You know you'll have to be your age. As I lie beside you, cover me like a gold cloud, hands everywhere. At last inside me where I trust you, then your tongue where I need you. I want you to make me come. Future conditional. After the supper dishes, let us start where we left off. My knees between your knees, half in the window seat. Oh, let me please, hands in your hair, drink in your mouth. Sweetheart, your body is a text I need the art to be constructed by. I halfway kneel to your lap, propped by your thighs, and feel burning my hand, your privacy, your part armor underwear. This time, I'll loose each button from its hole. I'll find the hook, release promised abundance to this want. Well, your hands, please, here and here... Exigent and certain openness it is, this book, made for your hands to read, your mouth to use.